Why can't men and women in relationships be friends with their exes? <laughs> really? <laughs> you want to answer that. <laughs> Because people are territorial, and you feel like once you had it once, you can always get it again. Oh. Point blank, period. Mm -hmm. That's what a man is thinking that another man might be thinking about his leg, especially if they used to date him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then this that's other man that's uh, the ex, he might be on some, well, let me just see if I can get it again, knowing that, you know, his former mate is in another relationship. Let me see if I still got it. You know. Yeah, to his point, men like challenges. Yeah. Oh. You know, so if, if it's the ex and we know it's a challenge, we're going to try to. It's just simple as that. Hey, women. <laughs> Some of them have a tendency to try to play one against the other. So, whereas you may be falling short, she would use him as, so to say, a ball on the other side of the court. Mm. Yeah, that's true. So, are you saying that men really should allow it? You won't allow it. Is that, is that no, my question? I'm not saying that. So, your girl, your Absolutely. wife, your girlfriend. Absolutely won't allow it. You won't allow it. Well, we'll won't allow it. Don't want it. Excuse me? I wouldn't want my ex to be friend or my girl, to be friends with her ex. <laughs> yeah, but because, because for all those reasons, you know, why do you need to be friends with your ex? You're in an intimate, sexual, personal relationship with that person. Why do you need to be friends now? You moved on. What type of friendship are you guys going to have? You're not, you're not going to go hang out. That's not going to happen. But you, know what, I, you know what? I used to be like that, but I kind of got to a point where if I trust her, Right. I trust her. I mean, well, that's the bottom line. You know, if, it, if, if, I, if I have a secure, that, that's just, that's just me. I used, I used to be like that, but now it's more so. I would allow it, yeah. I mean, if I have that trust level with her, then I don't see what's wrong with that. It's more so how you feel your, your trust level with your partner as opposed to, in a way, you have to trust that she's not going to let allow this ex, whoever, do or try whatever, and if they do, I'm trusting that she's gonna let me know. She's gonna handle it. Yeah. Well, I, the reason yeah. I say no, because I, I've been. If if her ex boyfriend or ex somebody came on to her, or or tried her in some inappropriate way, yeah, I would want her to let me know. Yeah. And, and if she did, and if she didn't like, she didn't let me know. Ah. I'm thinking that she got so nice. Why is, it, why is it important for you to know, though? Why is it important for you to know? Uh, it's from a, 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 like I say, if she doesn't let me know and I find out some other way, I'm going to be, all this other stuff going to be running through my head on why she didn't tell me. Personally, you know I, that's it. I went out with an ex one time, and I told my boyfriend when the guy talked to me, and I told him where I was going, and we were going to have lunch, and I was like, this is what it is. So then he didn't think, oh my gosh, you're seeing this guy behind my back. Because he knew oh, that yeah. this that I dated this guy once before and that things didn't end well. And he right. was like, oh, do you want to catch up? And I said, hmm, let me check with my boyfriend first. So just in case my yeah. Facebook hmm. is up. Yeah, no, And yeah. he's reading it. Yeah. I'm not lying about anything. But the and he, he was fine with it. He was like, I mean, I mean point yeah. Point is, bottom line, you informed your boyfriend. Yeah. And whether it was prior to or subsequent. Yeah. And you informed, okay. Right. That's basically what I'm saying. Yeah. It, 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 it was one word that was touched on that wasn't really elaborated. Most men, the male ego for most men is very insecure. Mm -hmm. So, go, going yeah. forward, e even if you are a secure man, the dude that she was with beforehand is probably insecure. So, he might feel some kind of way that you're with somebody else in the first place. So, that, that would cause him to try you because he is insecure.
what if the guy says, um, Which one, the boyfriend or the, 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 the ex? The boyfriend. Don't ask, don't tell. Like, that's the understanding that y'all already have. Right. Don't, don't ask, don't tell. If he don't ask about it, then you don't need to tell him right. that we went out. Right. Right. Well, right. Well, well, you you set the precedent in the relationship right. that way, then that's fine. Right. If both of y'all agree to that. That's fine. But I think yeah. to your point, if you, if right. someone doesn't let him know and he happens, she, she's outside with the ex someone, one of your friends see that and comes and tells you, you, don't, you just don't need all that. So I agree with what you said. If you let the guy no, know, know ahead of time, I, I agree with that. That's fine. And I think it, it lets him know that you're like, well, I don't think much of this. So then he feels at ease because he's like, well, obviously she doesn't really think much of it or she must not have that much, that many leftover feelings towards him because she's letting me know. I think when you get to the point where you're like, well, I don't want to tell him, then you probably have some ulterior motive for the meeting to begin with. Well, let me ask, did you, go ahead, sorry. I was going to say, you should not let your, yeah. your current girl go out with her ex, because if I was her ex, you're in trouble. <laughs> if, 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 if the dude is anything like me, and I'm the ex, there's a lot of guys like me. And if I can get your girl really is, to come out with me, <laughs> and she's with you, I'm not going to sit here and talk. You know, you I'm not, not going to ask her how her. Like him? No, but I'm like him. And I know it's not a lot like me. Uh, I'm not going to ask her how her day is going. I, I agree with Will. There's a lot of guys yeah. out there. And I don't, if you give them, it's, it's, it's not going to be innocent. Yeah, if you if they still have feelings for you, regardless. Because they wouldn't even ask you on the. They won't right. ask you that if they still if they didn't have feelings. That's actually what I was going to ask you. What was your intention? What was the point? Yeah, what? Of you even actually going on a date with the dude. Well, I didn't consider it a date on any caliber because I was, A, just going to be paying for myself and it was lunch and it was just like, hey. But what gave you that motivation? That's what I want to know. Why. Well, we were at, no, he didn't pay. I thought it was lunch. I mean, what, what, what motivated you? What motivated you? You felt so sorry for it. Right. I mean, because you, you have sorry. your own money. You felt so sorry for it. You know, it didn't end well. She felt sorry for him. So she went back with them. She felt sorry for him. Give us some background. How sorry did you feel for him? I did it for me. I didn't do it for any other reason. I think you know that I have done that. I didn't go out with my ex. I don't call that going out. But yes, we had a meeting. I did it for me. Because I needed to know what the hell went on with our relationship. Am I going to do the same bullshit again in this relationship? So I did it for me. It had nothing to do with my current. Had nothing to do with the guy I'm with now. Nothing at all. I did it for me. So I didn't feel like I needed to tell the guy I'm with now. So it was more so closure for you? Closure and pity. So was it closure for Alex? Was it closure for you? Please tell me how many of that closure. That's my question. I didn't really think so. I don't have closure. I do just want to get over somebody and get under somebody. It closed about three or four months before then. Then you closed then. Yeah. It's just like the end of it, the exit track. Man, yeah, yeah, we think of how to close. Yeah. And then after that, we... You guys don't feel like falling into the closure, do you? It's just over, it's over. Okay, Pretty much. I'm going to get it one more time so I'm going to be done with it. I mean, I mean, really, I want we, to we, we, we don't, we don't. <laughs> That's closure, right? Can I get it one more time? One more time. That's pretty oh much all we wrote. It's true, but that's what we're doing. So that's really what you're doing. You. Okay. <laughs> William, hold it. Is that William on you think? Because we have William okay, and on. we have <laughs> we have Anthony who is different from William, but is that is that what you think? Can I hit it I, one more I, time? I, I, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, brother. Yeah, I mean, I mean, Thank I mean, you. I mean.